Hello everybody, welcome to uh, uh, Game vs Elves with a Wizard. So, you know, this is the problem, isn't it? When you get to this kind of TV with chaos. Okay, it's not, it's lovely having a TV advantage. It's lovely having a TV advantage, but now they've got loads of dodge and blodge. <laughs> and they've got Edge 5 and they've got a wizard. So these kind of games that, on the face of it, it's a good matchup. The fact they've got the wizard makes this very, 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 very... Very, very dodgy. Um, no mad cam, it's fine. I, 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 you know, I, at the end of the day, if I say anything that an opponent can take advantage of, that's my fault, isn't it? Um, so there you go. Wow. It's, it's amazing what difference the light on the, the, what's on the screen makes, doesn't it? Like, that was my spread, that was my total Warhammer spreadsheet there, and it lit me up like a Christmas tree. Um, so yeah, what Mad Cam to us should do here is he definitely shouldn't spend that 20k, he should keep that 20k, he shouldn't scum anything. Oh, it's too late. A high L team. I, I didn't want to throw on high L's either. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a problem with the undead. Like, they do feel a bit light against, against Woody's. And against the orcs as well. I mean, his, his, his highest EV line here is just to concede. Then he doesn't take any casualties. So if I was him, I would just uh, I would just concede right now. I think that's probably the best uh, probably the best course of action that he's got is to just literally concede instantly um, and save his team. That, that's what I'd do. 10 out of 10, if you listen to Mad Cam, that's, that's the play that you want, need to go for here. <laughs> um, undead are good versus dwarves. Are they? Like, not really. They're not that, like, they're alright. They're not that good against orcs. They're not that good against dwarves. They're not that good against even. Okay, they're pretty good against gnolls. But they're not that good against orcs or dwarves. Um, I know he's right there. I'm I'm sorry, J5. I just I just did it. I just did hello. <laughs> Ten zero GG. <laughs> um, yeah, that that'd be okay, Lehman Russ. That'd be okay. Attrition fireball foul concede. I'd take that. I'd take that. In a pinch. <laughs> when he wins. <laughs> Hopefully he won't win. But obviously the wizard's gonna be gonna be a big thing, isn't it? And the blodge if the blodge holds up. If blodge holds up, if we roll pals, it's good. Well if we roll pals and removals, that could be good. Even the blodge. Now I'm regretting not going mighty blow tackle. Would have been quite nice, wouldn't it? Hopefully, don't get all bashed by this <laughs> by this zero kill skills team. <laughs> I just use it a lot, Dimmy. You can you can wash things. There's, there's, you know, amazingly, you can wash your mug and then uh, use it. The problem is, Dimmy, I do have several mugs, but I only have one mug that's this, this big, which is a pretty fucking big mug. So. Um, so I just use my big fucking mug all the time because it's fucking massive and I like a big mug. That's, that's quite a reasonable, quite a reasonable thing, isn't it? Big mug. I wasn't just calling uh, you a big mug there, Jimmy G, of course. I was, uh, I was just saying, big mug. I like a big mug. Big mug, tiny penis. I wasn't mugging you off. I quite like this. This is my anti... anti uh, shithead. What are they called? Um, what are these shitheads called? Um, I 
whatever. Anti-offset. Anti-offset LOS. What I like. Anti-offset LOS. Okay, wonderful. Get the ball into the cage if, if, with a pickup. Um. Okay, I think it's punched in. Three roll, one in nine. Allez, les gars, tous ensemble. So now, I probably should have done that first, obviously. Safe moves. Safe moves first and all that. Oh, yes. Alright, but get the, get the 3D now. Which is okay, isn't it? With a block character. <laughs> Alright, well, two cars on turn one is pretty fucking beautiful. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> Not even piling on. Don't need to. Oh, baby. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Oh, God, even made the pickup. Outrageous. Go in the cage. In the cage. Hello, Mithras. Yep, a bit of a dicing so far. A glorious dicing thus far. Two cars and a KO off the LOS. Wonderful. Hello, Jelly Deals. <laughs> yeah, it's fun. It's fun when you... <laughs> All due respect. Holy shit, help. <laughs> oh, dear. This is how you turn on a BB. Oh, no. Okay, he's not even dead. He's not even dead. Glorious. Why are we moving last for one square? So it'd be a bit of a bit of a more of a screen against like a wizard or whatever. You know, he could have he could have fireballed here or here, and uh, whereas this it it makes it so that it would hit less, wouldn't it? To uh, if he fireballed these three, he wouldn't fireball f all four, and it would also mean just a bit more like if he bolts, it makes it harder. There's an extra screen, isn't there? So that was the that was the idea there. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. <laughs> yeah, I haven't, I mean, haven't hit a blodger yet, to be fair. Removed the shitters thus far. I haven't tangled with his blodgers. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five. That's what we want to do. So get these in case of 
any uh, wizard bullshittery. Got the screen like layered. A screen in front of the uh, in front of the cage as well. Love to see it. 3DB with Pong. Let's go. Let's go, champ. Might pile on here. There's a chance. Oh, oh, okay then. <laughs> <laughs> hey <laughs> glorious big decision there <laughs> there's no really need for a vengabus here he hasn't got he hasn't got like a big sacking threat has he he's got the edge five who hasn't hasn't got like wrestle or strip he's got blockers i've got block so he hasn't got any uh he hasn't got any like um, real sacking, like he hasn't got a real threatening sacking player. The main threat is the wizard, so I want to make it so that if he bolts, we'll f make it so he can't fireball. We'll make it so a fireball is shit and wrong, first of all. And then if he bolts, there's like a web of tackle zones that he, it makes it very hard to penetrate. He hasn't got anyone left to foul with. <laughs> so if he wants to foul with his edge five or a catch it, be my guess. <laughs> be my guest, be my guest. <laughs> this is the real BB, yeah. Oh yeah, the law goes off from OFL. I really should uh really should uh get them back to the normal so that I don't need these anymore. But there you go, Pablo hello Pablo. He does have an edge five, but still, at least it's more dice rolls, right? He doesn't have dodge. That's why it's that's why it's a net of TZs because because he's got the edge five. Um, you know, he'd have to he'd have to make multiple dodges, and him making multiple dodges is uh, is more difficult, isn't it? Um, obviously, I could palm. <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, ex that's exciting, but this is the this is a real big threat here, isn't it? So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna knock him down. I'm not gonna reroll. <laughs> Wow, spending the full 15 seconds to choose dodge. Que faire contre un adversaire cornu lancé à pleine vitesse? Tu vises entre les deux yeux. There you go, that would have been a reroll wasted. But you know, it was hitting him into the extra extra hit, right? That was a. Uh... Pick the push. No. <laughs> <laughs> Make the wrong play on purpose. No. No thanks. Hello, Femi. It's gone pretty great so far. Four removals. Oh, congrats, Femi. I haven't got the chance yet. But um, there you go. Pick the push. Um, uh, because this is the bolt bitch, uh, Jellyol. Obviously, the block guy is the, the guy I care least about. 
Um, he's only got a skillless wrestle, so he hasn't got a real big um, threat in terms of, like, sacking threat. So, um, you know, I'd still, like, block is enough, isn't it, right? His edge 5 isn't as blockless. He's only got, mostly got block players. So I thought mostly the block's going to be a defensive skill. Mostly. Mostly the block is defensive skill. And uh, he's the bolt bitch. If he gets bolted, well, it's just a block guy, isn't it? I don't want to risk it on a valuable mighty blow character. <laughs> Very good for me. <laughs> right. So, one, two, three, four, five. We can go into here. He put himself in a big, a big, uh, what's it called? Big square. Then you've got five guys in this, in the six squares. <laughs> so he's opened up the uh, field majestically for us here. And put him in there just because. Puts him out of the way, doesn't he? Stick him in there as well, actually. Right, and then get in for the 3D. The lovely 3D on the defenseless guy. Should have hit a blodger. Well, I mean, I didn't get a chance to 3D. Oh, go on then. <laughs> Field, I mean, it is exactly, but it's especially harder when five of your seven players you put in a six, in six, in six, in a two by three square, doesn't it? Like just to make some two Ds. So like, he gets blocks back, but it is seeding. It's seeding it more, isn't it? Obviously, like, it wasn't. I wasn't doing that and calling him absolute trash for doing it, but. <laughs> <laughs> if you spread out, if you spread out, you get your good players pommed. If you bunch up, you get some hits and might remove somebody. Like, there's not a lot of good things to do, is there, in this situation? I didn't say there was. It's a shame that I can't hit back on it myself. It's nice being able to get the three DPs every time. Ooh la la! <laughs> really, Charlie? <laughs> Is that a thing that happens? Wow. There's no one in that corner. Does it matter? <laughs> Matters enough, I guess. Matters enough for me to stop it. Oh god, that was really uh, inviting a fireball there, isn't it? But then if we've got a screen in front, it's not so bad.
Yeah, that's why I didn't really like the, the. I know, I know, it's funny when you say the way you say country wizard, and it doesn't matter in JFW. To be fair, it doesn't matter at all in JFW. But I wouldn't want that said, saying it that way in, you know, in the Blood Bowl videos would be, uh, would be not great. No, he's got book. No. But yeah, obviously. Really, we can swear. It's not even swearing, is it? But still. Uh, people do, uh. Steve Motti. Um, I read a thing on Squared Circle that, that Bad Bunny's video got like 26 million views in half an hour or something. <laughs> <laughs> So, there you go. <laughs> People are crazy, I guess. It's the big takeaway from that. Alright, I've just got to try and do the best I can. Against wizards, haven't I? The ballon est en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. I mean, you could glorious. just dead status with it. No, I won't give in case. until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious. Um, thank you very much. Whoever that was. Sorry, I've got to do this. Oh, you motherfucker. By the way, right, the lack of block getting us a knockdown that wouldn't have happened if he had block. Wouldn't have greeted that, but instead, get a KO. Thus proving with all doubt, lacking block is the best strat. <laughs> all doubt is removed there. Um, with that one, one turn. And just forget about all the other turns where the lack of that block has been terrible. You forget all of those times, and just remember that one time then uh, it just proves beyond all doubt. Thank you very much, Smazzle. Smazzle, welcome to Team Fantastic. Thank you. Glorious. Yeah, YouTube doesn't care what you put up as long as you don't expect to Well, they, they care, like, but the, the C-nut is for monetization. So I wouldn't like all of my I wouldn't like all of my Blood Bowl videos to be demonetized, whereas all of the wrestling videos being demonetized is fine. But also, the thing the thing that also bothers me is the word that they put Cena on level with, and I would never want to say that, and I would be fine with them banning everyone who says that. <laughs> so I just personally don't want to because of that reason. So I'd rather not say it. Like, I mean, I, you know, I don't want to say it because they're American and Twitch are American and it's worse in America than it is here, apparently. Right, it looks like we're not going to see a wizard. So, I want to put the ball there, don't I? So now the fireball is already a lot worse than it would have been. I want another row outside of this as well. <laughs> Where's the edge five miles away? He can't react. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what you're gonna do, Mad Cam. I don't know what you're gonna do. I'll tell you. I'll tell you what you could do. You could fucking do it and then do. It. Oh yeah. Fuck off. I'm just gonna turn off this chat. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Maybe that's why people tell people to get out of the stream. Right. Settings. Sounds. Okay. 
Right, that's nice. No. <laughs> right, I don't want him to sidestep anywhere. I guess I want tackle zones on the ball if he does go in. Maybe I'll 3D him. Nah, just 2 into 2. What is it? Mad come to us, do you know what I mean? I've seen him around in streams, he just seems a dickhead, doesn't he? Oh, yeah, I could have agreed with it, I guess. I'll go, I'll leave him up there to protect. <laughs> Fair enough, Wolf Bye. Yeah, wow, 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 something, something, something. <laughs> Yeah, it is pretty good not having it on, to be fair. Chaque équipe a l'appui d'un clan majeur. Il y a les équipes du clan Strir, celle du clan Echin, et ainsi de suite. J'ai rien compris de ce chat, bien Ah, il me parle plus pendant au moins quelques temps. He probably doesn't know what Wang Nation is. Apparently, not a lot of people knew what Wang Nation was. Hello, Ordant. <laughs> Stalling out when you take a push pow is like the lamest BM ever. And then he said choose the push. As if I'm just gonna idiotically not give him the chance to misclick. <laughs> like if someone's got dodge on manual. We've all seen people misclick. I'm just gonna idiotically do that so that he like he's gonna time grief me so that I'll make the wrong decision. And then like what? It's just fucking dumb as fuck, isn't it? Wow. Nearly. <laughs> Nearly. Oh, let's not talk about Skuro's triggers. Oh, no. Let's... let's <laughs> don't. <laughs> don't. Oh, why is this... Why is this gun weird now? No, oh, they all come back. What a joke. Right. I'm going to trust in his ability to not be as good as K-Fog. Seems a fair assumption. Even though Art slated me for not seeing the K Fog move, uh, I thought it was a very good move. So, and something I had not seen in all of my games of Blood Bowl that I've ever played. So I thought it was a very, very good move from K Fog. Even though it kind of is obvious when you think about it.
Hello, <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I thought that was great. Like, it, it was kind of obvious, right? It's kind of obvious. Um, basically, dodging through and then filling in the squares to chain push this guy back. Um, <laughs> which I probably shouldn't have said since I'm playing this guy right now and he's in chat. <laughs> but he's probably not going to be able to learn how to do it. Um, but, you know, he had a, he had movement nine. To be fair, I don't know. Why is that? Maybe it's just dark today. Maybe it's just dark. All right, I'll, I'll try this. Um, yeah, in fairness, he had movement nine and sidestep, but it was still it was still cool. I mean, he didn't do it, but he was going to do it. Is it? <laughs> but then he got a quick snap, so <laughs> so he got. Um, that is true, Pedro. Yeah, that is true. That is kind of his gimmick, but. Um, <laughs> and you know, maybe I would have spotted it if I wasn't streaming, you know, and I was focusing on the game. Maybe I would have spotted what he was trying to do. But it just blew my mind at the uh <laughs> at the time it, it completely blew my mind. <laughs> but I mean I I wouldn't have thought of doing it myself, I don't think. I don't think I would have thought of it myself. But maybe I should have realised it at the time. But I mean, yeah, it was a great move. Yeah, so what he was, did was he had the movement nine sidestep, and I set up like this, and he, he, he was going to fill in all the squares, including this one. Um, and then blitz in there, push him into his one turner, sidesteps forward, then hit him again, sidesteps out, and then scores. So that was that was what it was, and it, it completely, completely blew my mind, and I had not seen that done before in all of the thousands of thousands of games that I played and the hundreds of games that I've watched. I had never seen anybody do it or attempt it, and I still haven't seen anyone attempt it because he got a quick snap and didn't have to attempt it. <laughs> He could have done. <laughs> he could have attempted it, and that's the important thing. Man, is this is this the thing? Three in, on the LOS. It's so niche that I don't think it needs to be named when I've literally only seen it once <laughs> and didn't get to see it, but would have seen it once in like however many thousand games I've played. <laughs> One day, just, Jesus. That's ridiculous. Uh, with quick snap, it was just insane because he, he just moved the one turner forward, so he didn't he didn't even have to chain push. He just did. He just did the normal. He just did it like he just blocked. He just blocked him, and it was just a blitz and block. Like I don't know. He did it easy. He probably could have done it with one. He did, he probably could have done it with one, but he, he didn't. He didn't do the three plus dodge. If you so want to be part of the team positive, dodge. then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? The big Kev setup. Have I played Muppet? Oh, it's Jimmy. It's Dimmy versus Muppet. It's a free win. <laughs> Has Spike got how many total games you've played? That's probably just in the stats here anyway, isn't it? I'll look at my coach's stats later. How many have I got on Fumble? 17, 9, 8 on Fumble. I think I've played more on Blood Bowl too. I might have played more on CCL.
What's that? Air in four. Yeah, played more more games on a uh, in CCL than on the entire year fumble. Crazy. Hey, <laughs> glorious in it. Really careful. Incredible. Oh yeah, I remember that Muffet, yeah. <laughs> well, if you can replicate your dice from that, that would be great, please. That would be great. No, I don't care. I don't, I don't want to dice it. Okay, I'm not going to qualify anyway, so... <laughs> if it was the final, I'd wish you, you got absolutely shafted by the dice. <laughs> but as it is, it's probably, <laughs> probably not going to qualify anyway, so there you go. <laughs> Did you see my armpits? No, you didn't. Did you? Maybe. <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> no, I don't. Why do you ask? <laughs> okay. Right, I guess... It's annoying that he got most of his team back, isn't it? I guess base up with warriors. Mostly. This guy is the furthest forward. Herp derp. Base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burp, burp, burp. Just do a safe. A safe block on him. I mean, he's the only one, so I should do safe moves, right? What am I doing? I want to base all the non dodge elves. I want to have him back as a safety. Three heat and go there, and heat and go here. Il vient au secours de ce joueur. Ça va faire mal. Encore un point. Yeah, elves having players, you know, it makes it tricky because they can do things, can't they? <laughs> elves can do things. Like even if they've got five, they can do things. So when they've got when they've got nine and they could have had six, you know, you'd have liked them to have had <laughs> not nine. <laughs> oh dear. Cover up you <laughs> cover up you slut. <laughs> oh goodness. Oh dear. Elves can just do things, can't they, man? They're just they're too good. They're all P, please nerf elves. You can be my wingman anytime. Bullshit. Glorious. Glorious Dio. Thank you very much for the raid, Dio. Hello, Dio viewers. Welcome to some beautiful icons. <laughs> and grass on the pitch. Um, but a worse blood ball coach. I do apologise. Nobody's perfect. Um, hope you had a nice stream today, Dio. How did it go? <laughs> the expected value of the stream just in <laughs> Wow, nice. Absolute banger, Dionysian, well known banger. <laughs> Professional banger. Banger of men's. He's done quite well to get the blocks here, hasn't he? He's maximised his two DBs. Which is what he did in the first half as well, didn't he? So I guess that's what he's going to try to do as much as possible. Oh, 
He's out of rerolls in his quest to maximize two DBs. So that's nice. With only one reroll left, maybe he should have uh, played safer. Like, you know, obviously it was fair enough rerolling that, that one. But maybe he should have played safer once that was gone. Um, so again, it's just stick stick people on, on the non-dodge guys, isn't it? Block and mighty do fuck all. You'll love to see it. No, I don't, but he probably does. Garden, even if this fails, he can tag him, can't he? Ah, les joueurs viennent au soutien de leur coéquipier. He's got the 2 plus out, so I guess he's got to go there and give him the 3 plus out. He's like making a screen with these guys, I don't mind just having him in the middle. Plus he's scary isn't he? He's scary, he might get, he might get scared by having this guy. <laughs> and we'll go, oh no, there's a Chaos Warrior! If I go on two, I guess I'm in range of hitting the ball next turn, which is something he wouldn't care about at all. But, you know, my if he was bad. This isn't great, is it? This isn't a great formation, but there you go. <laughs> yeah, exactly, yeah, Deb. Yeah, the opposite, yeah. <laughs> yep. No, Team and Taylor, no, no. You know. He's got to make him roll dice, right? He's got no rerolls left, even though obviously that's a dodge player. But still, whatever he does, it's going to take non-dodge players. He's got to activate. Um, he can he can fail things, can't he? He can fail things. I believe he can fail things. So if I take the ball down there, I could just remove myself, couldn't I? And then do nothing to him, and then there's suddenly a weak, a weak link over that side. Whereas by just taking the push, it's all... It's all gravy, baby. <laughs> I think it's terrible. Because <laughs> it's not dodge. Basically. That's my opinion on that. You can take dodge, or you can take something that isn't dodge. So, you know. Like, dodge is the best. It's fair enough on Lionel's not taking dodge, but when you've already got block, like on, the, on your Blitzer, you've just, you've just literally got to. You've got to take dodge. On. I don't mind going wrestle first, you know. I don't mind wrestle first on some Linos. Even even he didn't feel anything this turn. <laughs> well, that's pretty good, isn't it? How many twos was that? One, two. Th I mean, okay, these weren't because he had dodge. Um, or maybe they were. Yeah, these he didn't have dodge. So one, two, three, four. Bunch of two pluses makes them all. He can blitz him. Everyone else has got to be manned up. If 
possible. Behind them, if possible, as well. Something. It's not not easy this is it. I need him to fail things. <laughs> I need him to push or fail things basically. One of the two. <laughs> no it's not all done. I used to hate them. I used to, like, hate them and, you know, be childish, but not anymore. Maybe I should get somebody forwards so that if he double ones he loses, but... Well, not even double ones. Double ones with a with a elf or ones with a shitter. <laughs> like, he has got a number of shitters that he could just roll a one with. <laughs> yeah, exactly, backyard Dodo, yeah. First GFI of the game is just a guaranteed one, isn't it, against against Woody's, I mean, uh, Woody's any kind of elves, just Woody's are the best ones. <laughs> <laughs> so at least he's making a move. At least a bit of a move. Something's happening. Hey, fail. Yes. <laughs> I love the fucking high elves, holy shit. <laughs> the fucking sound effects are brilliant, aren't they? That <laughs> <laughs> right, gives us a couple of easy 2Ds. And uh, he, he did move his guy in range of, the, of a ball hit, but... Um, uh, double GFI, that's alright, isn't it? That's worth thinking about, at least. It's worth thinking about. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> um, I could also hit this guy. It doesn't really get me hit on the ball, though. But I'll do it anyway. Because it's sterile. Oh, I like that taste. <laughs> oh, flip me, guys. Maybe he's don't even follow. No, I'll follow. No, I won't. Alright. So the question is whether it's worth two GFIs to hit a blodger. Or just uh, hit somebody who isn't a blodger. Play a bit safer. Nice. Glorious. Push him back into there. I can just push him. Pushing him. Hope to base, base, base. Yeah, there was a way to hit the ball, but what's the point, right? What's the point? I'm, 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 use both my GFIs, so I hit him. 
I use my reroll, don't knock him over anyway after the reroll, or I knock him over and he just picks up the edge five anyway. You know? <laughs> How many teas do I drink a day? A lot. <laughs> An actual lot, because I've got a... Like, this is like two mugs of tea, isn't it, really? Um, a lot. Not Yorkshire tea. Not Yorkshire tea. Not PG. PG. I thought Yorkshire was better than PG. Yeah, I thought PG was shit. No. Maybe Tetley's was shit. And PG wasn't good. And Yorkshire's alright. But, um... Rington's tea is the best. Rington's tea is the best. Oh, yeah. Glorious. Right, next time we can start pushing on him, I think. Get somebody in the backfield. Hey. For this guy. Goes in the backfield. Obviously, got a bit him because he's the canoring threat. Well, not even canoring is absolutely scoring. Th he's an absolute scoring threat, isn't he? At the moment, no. Ah! <laughs> um, doing that doesn't do anything as you go the other side, anyway. So. Got him. Where does this guy go? Maybe a foul the catcher? He's only got three turns left. Maybe have two guys back. Jesus. No, R Rington's tea is, is glorious tea from uh... Oh man, Rington's chopped mallows are amazing. <laughs> but um... Ah. Damn it. That was a bit weak over there, I just couldn't really get anyone over there. I really wanted to get it. Maybe I should have done the 1D, right? I've got three rerolls. Maybe I should have just done the 1D over there. I think a, a, a leak in my game, if you like, is not doing enough 1Ds when they're relatively safe. Oh, no, Pablo. Yeah, but I could have re-rolled it right, so it would have only been a 1 in 9 for it to be not good, with a chance of it being great. It was it was worth thinking about. It was worth thinking about, at least, whereas I didn't think about it at all. They he rolled a 1, and that wasn't even get, to get the ball safe, was it? Um... Is this a pal? It is. Oh. 
to you. Right, so he can go GFI to base. And even if he's here, even if he's here, one, two, three, four, five, yeah, it's not so good. I'm gonna go up there so there's a screen. I like that. So this is a push to here and a follow he can go and hit the ball, yeah, so okay. I guess being able to hit the ball is the most important thing. Okay, get the power on there. It's best to not follow. Right, now I can GFI and re-roll the hit on the ball as well. <laughs> Don't need to do either. You'll love to see it. <laughs> Killed him as well. <laughs> Good God Almighty. Good God Almighty. That killed him. Obviously putting in both. Maybe he shouldn't have made the second gear oh, yeah. Maybe he shouldn't have stacked the oh, Could have stood next to the ball. Oh, yeah. But payoff's too great, isn't it? Picking it up as well. Means he's got a bolt in, basically. You might have forgot he had the wizard till I said that. Whoops. <laughs> Good God almighty. Dyson myself. GR he was indeed. Yeah. He was incredible. Rington's Rington's gold. Rington's gold. Team <laughs> two. Oh wait a minute. Yeah. I, I, I don't I don't know about Rington's gold. I just have Rington. <laughs> Do I do I have gold? No, it's like traditional. Rington's traditional or something it is. Gold are they? Traditional. Rington's tradition. Yeah, not breakfast. Not breakfast or gold. I don't like breakfast in general. Right, so he's stunned. He's got one turn left. He is not in range. So, he's not scoring. Wonderful. So now the only thing that matters is getting the ball, getting it to this warrior who wants to score. And scoring. Right. Now, how do I do that? Do I just go for the Claw Mighty Blitz? Silly question. So I chain up to there, and then he blocks him. So I need the guard in. Hey, he powered him anyway. Glorious. You'll love to see it. Just roll powers. Four, five, six. And then he can uh, lob it. If this guy is fucked. GFI. 
she will be by the power of wrestle. Definitely, definitely can't score. Can Let's do the pass. Oh, shit. The flim flum fuck. No, you dick! An idiot chaos warrior. Idiot chaos warrior. <laughs> the old spite bolt, classic. Why the fuck would you wizard in the first half, eh? <laughs> Oh, must resist the temptation. He's listening anyway. Oh, fucking leaper. The shitty leaper. Oh, this guy can just pick it up now. Instead of the warrior. I mean, it's it's okay to get on warrior, isn't it? But he's on twenty. Oh, one was on twenty-eight, wasn't he? This one was on twenty-eight. Oh, he's on thirty now. Oh, he should have done the pass. Fuck. All right, just go up towards Claw. Oh, I don't know. I really, really would like him because then he's a touchdown. Or an MVP away from guard. But it's two GFIs. And this is one. I'm not saying he should have done, no, but I mean, I had to defend against it, right? I had to defend against it. Like, obviously, he wasn't going to fireball then because I defended against it. But he was like, as if I would ever fucking do it, what the fuck? As, like, as if I was an idiot for thinking that he might possibly use it <laughs> when. You know, if I hadn't if I hadn't defended against it, he absolutely like I would have used it if somebody hadn't defended against it. So I absolutely had to defend against it. I thought it was crazy to think of not defending against. Like, why would I not defend against it? It's how he wins, isn't it? Like, it's literally it's pretty much only chances the wizard, or like me failing to power blotches. But you know, like realistically, after after the first two turns, where he's down so many players, his really only chance in from that point is uh, is the wizard, isn't it? Like at the start of the match, you could have just won anyway without the wizard, sure. But at that point, all right. So now you can't die in a handoff, so we'll do the handoff. Good. That's better, isn't it? Yeah, like like after the after the first after the first few turns, like before the game, it wasn't his only win. It was it wasn't his only way to win because it wasn't like a two thousand TV chaos team with loads of tackle and stuff. Um, but obviously, after removing four players instantly, um, <laughs> it starts coming down to the wizard is pretty much your only way to win. Again, not only, but your main way to win, isn't it? Your main way to win is the wizard. Like, and it, even if it's not your only way to win, it's still your main weapon. For sure, isn't it? Even if like you've got a good team, the 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 main way is always the wizard. Even if it's not the only way. Did I do any GFIs? I did four. Oh yeah, to hit the ball. Yeah, I can't remember what the other ones were for. I can't remember failing one. I didn't feel like I did any GFIs that game. But then um, maybe it's all at the end. Maybe all at the end. Jouer la régionale et disputer des matchs contre des adversaires à proximité. Sinon, vous pouvez aussi affronter. Oh yeah, yeah, stack them. Yeah, so two, two to pick it up. Yeah, two to pick it up, and then one to hit the ball. 
Oh, so that was three, wasn't it? That was three, because we're all four. Yeah, so there were only three GFIs. They were all on the same turn. They were literally all on the same turn. It was one GFI to hit the ball, and then two GFIs to pick it up. So there were only three. I was Because I was thinking, like, late in the game, I hadn't done any GFIs at all. And I thought, you know the first GFI that I make, I'm going to roll a one-on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, it was okay hitting the ball. There was there was no fail on the hit. It was the fail was on the pickup. Yeah, and I, I shouldn't have stacked them probably. I don't know, maybe. I don't know. I never know whether I never know whether to make the second one there. So I like to stack them so I don't have to think about it. <laughs> but there you go, glorious win without tackle. Just roll pals. Simple, simple chaos guide is just roll pals. Right, thanks for watching, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.